Hey everyone, today we're going to be talking about a really cool Google Chrome extension called TalkBerry. This extension allows you to speak to ChatGPT, a large language model trained by OpenAI, and receive voice responses. So let's dive right in and see what TalkBerry is all about. So the first thing you're going to want to do is come to the Google Chrome web store and search for TalkBerry. From there, you will have an option to add it to Chrome. Mine says Room from Chrome since it was already added. And then it will pop up here into this section over here where all your plugins are. From there, you can enable TalkBerry by clicking this and it'll pin it to the plugins page over here. And then when I click on it here, you can see Talk to ChatGPT. Please go to ChatGPT to use this extension. So now we're over here on ChatGPT. We can use the legacy model of 3.5 just for this example. Actually, we'll use the default model because GPT-4 takes a little bit longer to uh, provide answers and there's a limit when it comes to that. So in order to use this, you guys can go ahead here. You can click on how fast it's going to read it back to you, what language you would like to be in, and then also this button here to actually go ahead and record. So for example, let's go ahead and ask ChatGPT, what are some great recipes to cook during the summer? What are some great recipes to cook during the summer? Then we can click on submit. And it's going to say, there are many great recipes to cook during the summer. Here are a few ideas to get you started. And it kind of goes ahead, writes this whole thing out for you. Grilled chicken skewers, watermelon feta salad, grilled corn on the cob, pasta salad. I mean, these are just a few ideas. So I think it's really awesome that it can go ahead and do this. And you don't actually have to type. I think this can actually be a lot faster than typing because when you're talking, you can probably speak faster than 100 words per minute, and most people can't type faster than 100 words per minute. So let's say we want to talk in Spanish to it. Let's just change it to Espanol, add the playback speed still at 1x, and let's say, ¿Cuál es tu nombre? So let's ask ChatGPT what its name is. Let's see what it responds here. It might be funny. GPT. Soy un modelo de lenguaje diseñado por OpenAI, entrenado en la arquitectura GPT-3.5. Estoy aquí para ayudarte a responder preguntas y proporcionar información. ¿En qué puedo ayudarte hoy? You can see it has a really good native accent. It's not just like some white American guy speaking in Spanish. They actually went out of their way to get like native speakers, you could tell. And another thing that's great about this is it's completely free to use and it's extremely simple. If you want to mute that section and not have them talk, you can mute that there. And then you can go ahead and change the playback speed right here too. If you like to listen to things fast, kind of like I do, then bang, you're going to save 50% of your time by putting it in 1.5x. So another honorable mention for this video that I want to talk about when it comes to AI voice search is going to be just voice search. So go to the web store, search for voice search, add it to Chrome from here, go ahead and enable it right here and click on this and you can enable it. From there, I'm going to show you guys exactly how you could use this plugin and how I like to use this plugin. A lot of times I'm multitasking. I have three different monitors, so I'm doing literally three different things at once. A lot of times I don't have to have time to go ahead and type in exactly what I want to search for. And it's a lot quicker if I could just click a button and talk into my microphone. So I'm not losing track of what I'm doing on my other monitor. So for this example, let's pause this, change the search engine. You have a bunch of different search engines you can choose from, which I think is awesome. Let's pick YouTube because I love YouTube. And let's ask it how to make money on ChatGPT. And then let's see what happens from there. It should pop up YouTube. How do we make money with ChatGPT? And bam, just like that, it literally says, how do we make money with ChatGPT? <laughs> so it got it a little bit wrong. The word ChatGPT might be a little bit complicated for it, but as you can see, it works pretty well here. And that way, I don't have to leave my other screen if I'm doing something else. I can just click a button, talk into it. I can still have my mouse on the other screen multitasking, which is extremely, extremely powerful in my opinion. Overall, TalkBerry is an excellent tool for those who want to use their voice to communicate with ChatGPT. Its accuracy and natural sounding voice make it a great option for anyone who wants to use their voice instead of their keyboard. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more AI content. Thanks for watching.